Hey and welcome to the Ruby Tuesday, my name is Ruby and this is my review for Pretty Little Lies Original Sin. Let me know in the comments below, have you seen the original seasons? Where are you coming at this? I think it's okay for you to come at this afresh and start it as it's a kind of soft reboot, although it's not being called that, it's still in the continuity of the previous three. It gets quite complicated, but this is a prequel, so you can quite safely go into this going, okay, I'm going to start this. Based on books, let's talk about it. The series follows the lives of a group of teenage girls who begin receiving messages from the mysterious assailant named A, holding them responsible for something tragic that happened in the past. The series features an ensemble cast headed by Chandler, Kinney, Maya, Rafika, Bailey Madison, Zaira, and Malaya Pals. The first thing I should say is this is a very different feel to the original Pretty Little Liars uh, series. The the contrast of it was much bigger than I expected it to be. I expected it to be teen angst, angst in amongst the texting game of them trying to figure out who's basically stalking them and calling them liars. This time around, they're really leaning into the genre of I know what you did last summer and scream. And I found it actually much more entertaining than the original. I know some people are not going to like me saying that, but I actually prefer this dynamic because there is a ser serious amount of tenseness right from the beginning. It doesn't shy away from the blood and gore kind of giving that slap and vibe we also have that teenage angst but you also just as just within the first episode they start going down the route of what is going on we have that big climax beginning of okay something's going to happen to put all of these teenagers and adults in jeopardy there's a thing in the past that's going you know i know what you did last summer sort of vibe and then we're going to have a killer that has the ability to seemingly you look at him you turn your head and he disappears all of those kind of cliches that you would have in an i i know what you did last summer the scream movies or the scream series that is what you get in here now i would say it's not doing anything original it's not like ticking anything new boxes but it's pulling from those series whether it's a homage or or uh, paying patronage or just literally copying it still does it quite well so in amongst the teenage angst and those relationship with who's going out with who it also manages to be quite fun and entertaining because you kind of want to know what's going to happen to them i also immediately at the beginning chose the characters that i like because the story kind of pushes you down the length of these are the good guys and these are the bad guys the kind of teenagers that are just mean and angry and horrible and easy to dislike they play their parts well and the ones that you think are good but as the lines start to intertwine and their parents what their parents have done in the past start to come to the surface you start seeing that story puzzle piecing come together but there is enough gore to keep the slasher fans happy there's enough intrigue to keep those mystery fans happy and there is enough teenage angst to keep the demographic that this is pitched at happy it's based on the books obviously but they're kind of doing their own thing now it is very entertaining i would put this on your list even if you're not a fan of like the teenage angst series or the pretty little eyes the, the more like the scream kind of the scream queens that kind of series i think you're gonna find some entertainment in this and to give this three and a half nicholas cage out of five let me know what you thought about the ending do you want more from this i think it's probably something that hbo max are very excited about a lot of people are watching it and it seems to have a, a decent quality to it it's not quite on the length of like the cw teenage angst series but it has a higher quality than that i think let me know your thoughts down below thanks so much for watching but most of all until next time remember live long tuesday